Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I am Carolyn. I am in the Magic Kingdom. I'm very happy. Um, I haven't been to the Magic Kingdom since Valentine's Day? Question mark? That feels right. Um, we were blocked out. There were just no reservations available. But I finally snagged one and I'm here in the Magic Kingdom and I'm power walking to the Haunted Mansion because supposedly it's only a 30 minute wait right now. And I have not been on the Haunted Mansion since the, uh, the Hatbox Ghost materialized. And I wanna see the Hatbox Ghost. So power walking to Liberty Square, but oh, I'm just so happy to be in the Magic Kingdom. And all I plan on doing today is just soaking up the Magic kingdom myth. Oh, she's so pretty. It's been too long. I am just not realizing I left all of my snack coupons at home and I could go for a churro right about now. As if I haven't been here for literally 20 seconds. It's always time for a churro. Spooky. One must always pay their respects to Master Gracie laid to rest. No morning please at his request. Hi Leota. I'm so scared right now. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Is this haunted room actually stretching, or is it your imagination? Mm -hmm. Make it too terribly far on the tour before uh, playful spooks have interrupted your journey. Uh, so I'm getting a really good look at the portrait gallery. They're very spooky. I'm so scared right now. Playful spooks have interrupted our tour. See, playful spooks have interrupted the tour. There he is. He looks so cool. I don't know how well he's coming across on the incredibly dark camera, but he looks so cool. <laughs> Goblins and ghoulies from last Halloween, awaken the spirits with your tambourine. Who are we gonna get? Nobody. There's no hitchhiking ghost. Interesting. Alrighty. He looked so good. I don't know how to describe him, but his head in the hat box wasn't just a projection, it was three dimensional. Um, I also noticed that they relocated the chair that kind of looks like Donald Duck to um, the library with the, the busts that follow you as you walk, like, you know, as you drive by. Uh, any other things that I noticed? Oh, the mummy was back after very long of being gone. Ooh, do I have a photo shoot by the Tangled Restrooms today? No, it's busy. Um, we're going to pull off to the side because I want to eat lunch, but I don't know where. Probably Pinocchio's. The answer is always Pinocchio's. Okay, I lied. I did have a photo shoot by the Sangled Bathrooms. We'll insert the pictures here. Oh, it's a small world since it's a 10 minute wait. You know where I'm going. I just, oh, you know I love it in there. But now I'm like hungry, so yeah, we're, we're going to Pinocchio's. But I don't know, pizza or chicken fingers? Probably chicken fingers, I don't know. While I wait for my mobile order, there's a new It's a Small World collection out and I think I need to show y'all. They don't have everything here, but they have a lot of it. 
do I need any of it? We got this super sweet uh, zip up hoodie. They don't have my size or anything. Eh, they have a small and XL and extra small. I think I'd need a medium or a large, but I love this. New spirit jersey. Look at it. And then it says it's a small world on the back. So cute. New fleece blanket. Is this a tote bag? A new tote bag. And we first, although we can't forget the creme de la creme, the ears. They're just, oh, I love that It's a Small World is finally getting the recognition it deserves. I went with a kid's meal today. So we got half a pizza and french fries, but I also mainly just got the kid's meal because I wanted to drink. With that being said, I think I want to dole with today. But I'm going to eat my kid's meal first. On the lovely balcony. Excellent view of fantasy land. But, um, yeah. Oh, it didn't cut all the way through. I think I did a pretty nice job of that, but, um, yeah. I'm gonna eat this. We'll figure out what we're gonna do afterwards. Afterwards. Decided where I'm going. We're backtracking slightly because Pirates of the Caribbean is supposedly a 15 minute wait. So we're gonna go back through Liberty Square, through Frontierland, take a look at Tiana's Bayou Adventure, excuse me, because they have to be getting pretty darn close. They keep sending out snippets. The animatronics look fantastic. Um, so I want to see how that looks. And then we'll pop next door to Pirates, and then Pirates is right by Dolan. So I'm on a, I'm on a mission. I got distracted from my mission. I'm meeting Peter Pan. Back on the mission, Peter Pan had no line, so I felt bad and I met Peter. And honestly, Peter was fantastic. Um, need to look at the picture. I think there was a singular picture taken. Need to look at the picture. But now, Onto Tiana's Bayou Adventure. Oh, I think a parade. Wait, what time is it? Oh, we're not even close to the three o'clock parade yet, but they're starting to set up for it. Let's go. So first of all, we got this sign that says we are ride testing opening. Oh, we are ride testing only opening this summer. Whoa, that is a big fish. Sorry, I got distracted opening this summer. This is the best look we're gonna get, but look how fabulously green she looks. There's so much life. I don't know if you can tell, but there's like flowers all over the place, but I think they kind of get swallowed up by the green, which, you know, very appropriate for Tiana, but you know, haven't been inside yet, but looks 10 out of 10 from the outside or what I can see, you know? Looks like the wait has jumped up to 25 minutes, which honestly is still fantastic for Pirates of the Caribbean. Well, I'm gonna go there now. I say gonna go there now as if I'm not actively standing in front of it. I acknowledge it is pitch black right now, but I got the back row of the boat. Yeah, you can't see me at all. I didn't get wet. I always get blasted by those gosh darn side cannons. But I was alone in my row today, so I didn't get wet. But uh, now it is dull with time because it is sunny. I got the tropical serenade. Duh. Wait, I gotta find a straw. Straw. Couldn't find a straw, but I found a spoon. So we're gonna make it work. No longer in danger of spilling. So, new game plan. 
We're walking back through Adventureland, Frontierland. Actually, I'm just in Frontierland now. We're walking back through Frontierland into Liberty Square to go back into Fantasyland to go through Fantasyland to Tomorrowland because I should maybe go to all sides of the park before leaving today. Plus, I kind of want to see if the Little Mermaid to walk on because if it is, I'm going to ride it. If not, we're just going to keep going on to Tomorrowland. Obsessed with this tableau. I'm not kidding, I think I'm the only person on this. And darkness. Like seriously, it's just me! I need sunglasses. Oh sweet. Oh my goodness. Alrighty. On to Tomorrowland. So I can do a lap on the people mover and call it a day. Maybe I'll stop by Storybook Circus. I don't want to ride anything in Storybook Circus. But I kind of want to stick my head in the gift shop. See if there's anything I need. So far the answer's been no. But you never know. Was a bus in here, but smell. It's incredible. Unmatched smell right there. On to Tomorrowland and the sunlight. Y'all, I could cry. The people mover is also a walk on. It's just Magic Kingdom knew I was coming today. And it said, no lines for Carolyn. This is the TTA Blue Line non stop service around Community of Tomorrow. Did you know Progress City inspired Epcot? And a lot of the visionary ideas throughout Walt Disney World. Look, there's even a tiny people mover. On your right is Star Traders, home to the greatest good. pretty much all you can see from here. Uh, yeah. Whoa. It's cooler in my eyes than it is on the camera, but you can kind of see Ariel through the trees. Not as well as you can see Maleficent, and you can't hardly see Maleficent. Since Festival of Fantasy is going on, I think I'm going to delay my park exit slightly so I don't get stuck on Main Street by doing the Carousel of Progress because she is also a walk-on, and I love her. No privacy at all around this place. Sorry, Orville. I think I successfully killed enough time. It's almost four o'clock. I'm gonna make my way down Main Street, onto the monorail, back to my car at the TTC. Oh, I'm so satisfied with today. I did so much with so little wait time. Hello everyone from my apartment now. We uh, we changed into our PJs because it was a little sweaty. Um, where did I put my water? I left my water in my bedroom. Okay, um, so we're gonna keep this quick. It was so fun in the Magic Kingdom. It's been so long since I've been, and by so long, I mean like a month. But that's long for me because the Magic Kingdom is my park, baby. Um, and like, the park was busy, 
but nothing had to wait. But the walkways were full, but nothing had to wait, which is excellent because I did, yeah, things I normally would do, like Pirates of the Caribbean or Haunted Mansion, because normally they have like 45 to 60 minute waits. And I'm like, I don't want to wait that long. But if it's less than 30 minutes, yes, I'm going to wait for it. Um, yeah, all around. Good day at the Magic Kingdom. I do have work tomorrow, so I've got to figure out something to make myself for dinner and go to bed bright and early because I have to wake up bright and early tomorrow. But yeah, hope y'all enjoyed this uh, very cathartic Magic Kingdom day for me, and I will see y'all again real soon. Bye!